Hi, right now, ladies and gentlemen, we are right now at the Thai and Sankoi section. And I believe that nobody can tell us more about this section better than Mr. Ron. So, hi, Mr. Ron. How are you? I'm good. So, could you tell us a little bit more about yourself, please? Yeah, well, I was born in the United States, but I came to Thailand about 45 years ago yeah. and never really left. <laughs> <laughs> but when I was a little kid, I used to like to collect coins. But these are normal things that you use money. But when I came to Thailand, I found all these ancient type coins. Very interesting. Things that don't exist anywhere else in the world. Coins like this. No other country has them like this. Okay. So this is how you feel interested in this? Because yes. it's so special. Yes, very special. And in this auction here, we have some of the most special coins. Potuong or bullet coins go back for about six, seven hundred years and they were used in Sukhothai in Ayutthaya and they were used as money but then in Rama IV's reign they made some commemorative coins. These are two of them. These are 80 baht coins. Very valuable. They're cast and made. They weigh 80 baht so they weigh about 1,200 1, grams. They have the royal marks on them, the chak yeah. and the monkut. Mm -hmm. And then these are very, what we call deep engraved. Mm -hmm. So these are older ones. Yeah. Later people wanted more of them, mm -hmm. so they made more of them. These are not so deep. Then in Rama V's reign, he issued a set of coins in commemoration when his age equaled the age of his mother when she passed away. So he issued a, a unique set of 80 baht, 40, 20, 10, 4, and 2 baht. So this is one of the most desirable sets in the world. In the world right not, now. Not merely Thailand. Mm -hmm. And anybody who buys this set yeah. is very lucky because this is an absolutely beautiful set. Mm -hmm. I think it's the only time that a full set came into auction. Several years ago, one 80 baht came into auction, this auction and sold for about 8 million baht. Mm -hmm. So now we have a whole set. Yeah. So I don't know what it will sell for, but it should be, <laughs> it should be for a very good price. Mm -hmm. And one who wins will be very lucky. Oh, okay. So could you tell us a little bit more? Because somebody may ask, like, why is the price so high? Like, you say it's valuable, but what kind of value that you would give it the grade that you will pay for it? I mean, okay, one value is determined by many things. Mm -hmm. Supply and demand. Supply, yeah. <laughs> there are very, very few sets. Yeah. Supposedly only eight of these were made. Only oh. eight of the 80 baht. Mm -hmm. We think some were made later because people wanted them. Yeah. But a whole set is extremely rare, so we mm -hmm. have very little supply. Mm -hmm. Then demand, everybody likes Rama 5. Mm -hmm. So if you want something unique from Rama 5 and something that he personally ordered and yep. probably personally presented to people, <laughs> this is the set. Ah, so see. it must have an extremely high price. <laughs> okay. So we could uh, we could see it now. Yeah. However, could you right now tell us a little bit more about auction? How, how come you become so um, fond of it? Well, if you want to buy, if you want to find rare coins, the only place to find them is at an auction because when people die or their heirs have mm -hmm. coins or they need money, they put it in auction yeah. and it's a way for interesting people interesting to come and buy them. Uh, okay. You could also go to dealers in the market and friends and you can find them. But in auctions, not only in Thailand but in other countries, that's the place to find these rare coins. So and it's also like more trustworthy, you mean? Yes, well, if it's in an auction from a reputable company like Ursary Auction, then yes, they guarantee and you know it. If you buy it on eBay, maybe not so much. And if you buy it in a local market, yes, there are many, many fakes around. But these look very good. Okay. I'm sure they're real. <laughs> okay, then thank you very much, Mr. Rod. I really, really appreciate it and I feel that it's really worth it. It's it so beautiful, I mean, it's so beautiful. Yes. Well, thank you very much anyway.